All right, you guys, today we're gonna check out how to make a retro pixelated effect inspired from old mobile phones and Game Boys. I'm gonna go with this image size. Now let's go to the layer, right click, convert a smart object. And from here, we can go to the filter, filter gallery. And here first, we're gonna go to the texture and select green. Now I'm gonna go with lower settings and I'm gonna go down here, click on the plus and go to the sketch here and select the photocopy. I'm gonna increase the details high and also the darkness. And as you can see, if you turn off the grain, it is going to make it more contrasty and it's going to emphasize a lot these lines in here. So we get the grain that is going to eventually distribute this effect a little bit more equally. And from here, we're gonna click OK. Let's go back to the filter, pixelate and select mosaic. I'm gonna try it out with 20 cells, click OK. And now we're gonna go to the adjustments, scroll down and select the threshold. And here on the threshold, you can pull this handle. So I'm gonna pull it up. So this way is going to bring up the details on the model's face. It looks quite ugly, but you can adjust the settings to balance the effect. So let's go down to the layer. And as you can see, we got here the filter gallery with the filters applied. And on the right side, we got these handles. So I'm gonna double click on it and it's gonna show up the blending option. So you also can change up the blend mode, but I'm just gonna decrease the opacity to somewhere around 50%. And as you can see live, how it's gonna look, actually I'm gonna go somewhere around 70. Let's see what happens, click OK. So now we got some new results. I'm gonna go back to the threshold and I'm gonna decrease it to clean it up. So now as you can see, we got some better results, but I think I'm gonna need to decrease it more to clean up the lips as well. So I'm gonna go to the filter gallery double click on the handles and I'm gonna decrease from 70. This is actually great. I'm gonna click OK and I think we're good. I'm gonna go back to the threshold and there it is. I think this is pretty much enough. If you want, you also can go back to the mosaic, double click on it, increase the size. This actually works really good. Now I'm gonna click on the threshold. Let's go back to the adjustments, select the gradient map, click on the gradient and we're gonna change up the colors. I'm gonna to go to the black, double click on the handle and I'm gonna make it some blue, you know, dark blue, click OK. And the other one, the white is gonna be the green. Click OK and click OK. And that's how you achieve this retro pixelated effect here in Photoshop. Thanks for watching.